My question is more nuanced. You sat in this courtroom while Officer Sines testified that she saw you the night of May 21, 2016, face to face, and didn't see any injuries on your face. Isn't that correct, Ms. Hurd? I believe she was testifying about these photographs, and she said that I was not injured in them. Is it your testimony under oath now that Officer Sines testified that she saw injuries on you when she saw you in person on May 21? Sorry, let me clarify. I was testifying that I know that that's what Officer Science said, that she didn't consider my red puffy face injured. That's what she said. The red puffy face, that was your counsel's question, correct? Uh, that was she her said, testimony in the UK. That's incorrect, and you know that, Ms. Hurd. I disagree. It's just inconvenient for you that Officer Science didn't see injuries on you on May 21, 2016. Isn't it doesn't matter right? what's convenient for me. Right. Officer Tyler Haddon also testified by deposition about being called to the Eastern Columbia building on May 21, 2016. And he also testified no injuries on your face on May 21, 2016. Isn't that correct? They both said that they did not consider me injured. They did not see injuries on your face on May 21, 2016. Isn't that what their testimony was? What their testimony was is that they did not consider what my face looked like to be injury. They didn't consider what they walked on in the house damage, but it was. You were sitting here when Officer William Gatlin testified by deposition about being called on May 21 to the Eastern Columbia building, and he also did not observe any injuries on you, did he? he and that's what he testified to. He didn't even know which one I was.